Hello Internet, welcome back or welcome to my channel. My name is Tori and today I am going through this bin and decluttering a lot of the lip products we see in here. So let's jump into it. First things first, I am going to sort everything by brand because that is going to be the easiest for me. Yes, Rosie. So let's just jump into me sorting that. So now that everything is messily sorted with the cat sitting there, I'm placing the red basket behind her and that is going to be the declutter pile. So everything needs to be smell tested because I haven't opened a good handful of these since the summertime. And I realize where I keep most of these is not a good environment. They're right by a heater now. Um, so I really need to smell every single one of these, see what's still good. I'm not going to go biggest brand first because as you can see, Lime Cram and Sugar Pill are kind of duking that out for the biggest spot so they can just chill up here by me. So I'm going to go for these first. These are the iHeart Revolution brand. This first one is the iHeart Revolution Vinyl Cherry Liquid Lipstick in Cherry Blackwell. Oh, it still smells good. Yes, I love this. They discontinued this line and it kind of pissed me off, not going to lie. This is a very nice liquid lipstick. Next, I'll do the non Aristocats Lip Gloss. And this is uh, from iHeart Revolution, the Chocolate Cherry Lip Gloss. This one also still smells good, so this one will keep. It's in the shade chocolate, but it's really a cherry color. And then I have my Aristocat glosses. So this is Toulouse. Toulouse smells good, wonderful, wonderful. And then last but not least, Marie. Marie also smells good, great. Very happy about that. Next, NYX Cosmetics. Right off the bat, I'm going to get rid of this. This is the NYX Powerpuff Lippy and Squad Goals. I bought this off a recommendation from Tati when they came out in like 2018. So um, this is the oldest liquid lipstick I have currently. So it's getting chucked. Next, I'm going to talk about the suede. So this is Kane's. Kane smells good. Wonderful. I love this formula. And then this next one is Ace. Ace also smells good, which is surprising because Ace was the one I bought first. And then I have the Butter Gloss in Eclair. Ooh, Eclair does not smell good. I am going to get rid of that. I am not going to put that on my lips. Okay, Lime Crime pushed the e.l.f. ones up next, so we'll also do this little section next. This one was the most recent one I got. This is the Hydrating Core Lip Shine in Lovely. Ooh. Hold on, I can't tell. Because I know it smells like watermelon, but it like threw me off for a second whether or not it smelled like watermelon. It still does, so I will keep it, but that one scared me for a second there. Which one of these is the oldest? I think these are like the O oh, Seriously or something line. I have Nectar. Let's smell Nectar first. Oh, Nectar, you were smelling off. I'm so sorry, Bestie. And then this one is Taffy. Taffy also smells off, which makes sense because Taffy was the oldest. And then last but not least, I have Sociable. Yeah, it, it smells off. Rosie, Rosie. Come here, Ro. Sit here. Get your butt out of the camera. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Sit. Sit. Okay. I'm going to try to do this with a uh, hand petting a cat. It's not going to work out well. Next off the bat, I have Huda. Man. 
bro for real for real for real okay so the small one is spice girl my one issue with huda is a lot of her stuff smells like cinnamon this one is medusa but i loved the formula and the color i don't know it smells a little funky like they're not completely off but the cinnamon just smells a little funky so they're going i'm not dealing with that next this one is automatically getting decluttered i don't even want to open it this is the Pat McGrath. This was a trio. It had this one, a like pink one, and an orange one. Um, and this is in Christy. They, can I show you? Or is this one normal for now? They do that all the time. Um, so the other ones ended up getting decluttered because they would land on my floor. And as you can see, I have cats. So that's a no-go. Bro, <laughs> come on, man. Rosie. Come here. Come on. Come here. Come sit next to me. Yeah. Next, I have two from Kendra Vegan Beauty. So I think the oldest is Dagger, which is this gray one. Dagger still smells fine. I'm going to keep Dagger because it's fun. I really do like a color like that. And then this one is Bow and Arrow. Bow and Arrow also smells good, so I am going to keep that. Next, we will do my LA Colors. These are also some of the oldest I have. I think I received especially these two. Uh, Christmas 2018 and Christmas 2019. Let's smell them. These two don't have names, so I called this one Nude Rosie. Oh, God, Nude smells bad. Even though you can't tell. And then the berry one. Why does the berry one smell fine? I've used the berry one more. Okay, I'm going to keep the berry one for now. Rosie, you really got to take a hike. Come on. Go to bed. Go to bed. Next, I have the LA, LA Colors Holographic Lip Gloss and Heavenly. This one does smell off, so I'm just going to chug it. Um, if you've watched my other videos before, yes, I am a project painter. So I am, obviously, that item is currently in a project, but it is getting decluttered because I really should not be using it. Um, so then that goal will just be done for that project. Next, I have Milani. So the bullets are the oldest so i'm gonna smell teddy bear first because this is definitely the oldest one what I, they still smell okay what and then this one is rose they still smell good they sm still smell like cherry medicine um and then this is the milani keep it full nourishing lip pumper in moonlight this is a lip plumper Oh, that one don't smell good. That one gotta go. That one gotta go. <laughs> um, next. Too Faced. Too Faced. Let's jump into it. Um, these are all old. I do not buy from Too Faced anymore. Um, I think the quad is the oldest. So let's see if they still smell like what they're supposed to smell like. So this one's sugar cookie. I don't know. I feel like it's technically the correct smell. But we'll see. Caramel apple. Caramel apple still smells fine. Candy cane. Candy can, I think I'm just going to chuck because I don't, I don't care for the peppermint smell. It wigs me out. Hot toddy was definitely the one I used the most. I kind of want to chuck hot toddy because I don't like this, the spice type of scent. Similar to Huda, the cinnamon scent, I don't care for it. Um, 
honestly, I wouldn't care if I chucked both of these right now. So next is the Melted Metallic and I want to rock with you. I think I like this one. Please don't be expired. Uh, it's expired. Mm. <laughs> Damn. Okay, next. I think these are all the lipsticks I have from Farms, Farm, Pharmacy, Pharmacy, whatever. It's an MLM I do not support, but I was gifted these from a relative, so I'm going to see if I want to still use them. I forgot this is a declutter, not a collection video. I can't get rid of shit if I don't want it. This is in heat wave i never opened it and eh, it smells bad and i just opened it that was my first time opening it this is money maker they don't smell good they like smell like plastic um rose dream Like, why, why are they smelling like plastic? Lipstick's not supposed to smell like plastic. What are you putting in there? Flamingo pink. Plastic. What the frick? And then I... Did I use this one? This is Cool Girl. I think I did use this one the other day. Once again, they smell like plastic. Why? 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 Should not be like that. Trash. Okay, <laughs> I think I'm going to start going through my uh, Lime Crime lippies because they're a lot and I just keep leaning on them and moving them all which ways. So, I don't know if I ever talked about when I stopped supporting Lime Crime and then starting supporting them again. Um, but that is what has happened. So right off the bat, I did buy something on Black Friday. Well, technically two things. So all of these are new. This is Blue Flame. This is Cement. This is Squash. This is Trouble. And this is Suede Berry. I bought a bundle with these in it. And then I also bought this trio, which is Luna. Blood Moon, and Wicked. So now these guys. The Wet Cherry Gloss and Extra Extra Popping is pretty much brand new. Yep, still smells good. Perfect. Love it. My favorite clear lip gloss. For real, for real. Um, let's see. These are old. The Unicorn Lipsticks. Choker is the oldest. It still smells good. This one's going to be a maybe for a second, because I don't know if I still want it. And then this one is Candy Floss. Candy Floss also smells good. Candy Floss is 100% staying. Do I want to keep Choker? I think I'll let myself keep Choker. Next, for the soft touch, I bought Disco Down, which is a purple. Still smells good. We are in the clear. Next is the Lime Crime Plushies and Blackberry. This is old. Let's see. It still smells good. So honestly, I do have this in a project currently. I'm just going to keep it till I finish it. Um, <laughs> I really do like that one. Next is the Light Lip Pops and Macaroon. This one has always smelled funky, but I think it kind of concerns me. Like... I don't like whatever the scent they put in this product is, so I'm going to chuck it for that reason. But I do honestly like the whole mechanism. And then last but not least, this trio. So the first one is Red Velvet. Red Velvet is expired. No honey, no honey, no. This is Wicked, which I know now I technically have a full size. So I can get rid of this one, which is good because this one smells off. And then last but not least, I have Lana. Ooh, Lana smells like glue. She going. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Okay. 
Oh, I forgot a Milani product. This is the Milani Fruit Fetish in Strawberry and Lemonade. I am keeping this. I love this. I guess we'll do Sugar Pill because now I'm like also laying on them awkwardly. So, I only have two lip glosses, right? I believe so. I have Crystal Trinket. Still smells like orange and cream. We good, baby. And then this one is Swipe Left. Oh, God damn, you do not smell like orange and cream, bitch. You gotta go. <laughs> bye bye. Oh, that pains me, not gonna lie. Anyway, um, who's my oldest here? Let's see, who is my oldest? Okay, uh, Ring Pop and Teacher's Pet are one of my newest, along with Anti Social Light, and this was a new trinket. So I think these are my four oldest leading off with uh, Strange Love. So let's see. <sighs> Strange Love does not smell like orange and creams, which means it's time to go. Next, Pillow Fight I used a couple days ago and it smelled good. Mm, I lied, it's starting to smell off. So I am going to chuck it because who knows if I will use it before it fully goes off. Next is Vertigo. Oh, vertigo's off. Damn. And then last but not least, hijinks. Mm, that pains me. Hijinks is also off. I might repurchase hijinks. I really love that one. That one is the magenta with like the blue shift. Beautiful. Next, trinket. Trinket still smells good. She is staying my classic. Next is anti social light. Still smells good. She is staying. Next is Teacher's Pet. Still smells good. She is staying. Let's go. And then last but not least, Ring Pop. Still smells good. She is staying. Love it. Love to see it. Next, I got two Rogue Ones from Ulta. Actually, I'm supposed to have three. How do I keep losing this one? I have a liquid lipstick that's in this exact color and I keep losing it. I don't know where it goes. Anyway, this is a tinted lip oil. The lip oil's going, smells like plastic. And then this is a lip gloss. The lip gloss can stay for now. And the liquid lipstick is gonna stay because I can't find it. And it's gonna show up right when I'm done filming. Next, I have two Fenty glosses. I have Fenty Glow. This one is newer, so it should be okay. It is perfect. If it wasn't, I was honestly going to start break down crying. Um, and then I have Sweet Mouth. Sweet Mouth also smells good. Let's go. I only have a couple like big groups left before I have all my miscellaneous. So starting off, we have Urban Decay. Now, some of these are old, or is it just this one's old? This is 1993. 1993 is expired. She got to go. She's also from like 2018. I think I bought all of these last year at my birthday. So let's see what's good. This is Trip. Can't tell. I think Trip might be off. That sucks. This is Tampered. I can't tell. So Tampered can stay for now. Next is Disturbed. Disturbed smells fine. She is staying. And then this is a Moon Dust in retrograde I can't really tell so she will stay for now I have two from CoverGirl I thought I had another one but apparently I do not I have a color CoverGirl tinted lip oil in what are you in quench 
Um, I've been trying to pan this unofficially, so I'm just going to keep it till it's done because I feel like there's nothing left in it. And then this is a cover girl. This was a duo with a, uh, lipstick in 621. It smells weird. So it's going. Next, I have two of these, uh, Romantic Bear Wine Duos. I'm keeping both of them. I have no idea if they're cruelty-free or not, but I kind of just like the gimmick. Um, I received these as gifts from relatives, so I have uh, Merlot Burgundy and I have Rose Coral, so I'm just keeping both of them. I don't have many lip tints, so they can stay. Um, next, I have two from Medusa's Makeup. These should be expired. Uh, this is Strip Tease. Yeah, it smells like Play-Doh. And this is Shag. Also kind of smells like Play-Doh. So, just as I thought. I feel like this is... Number one, do not keep your lipsticks in places where they can get heated by a heater. And, and make sure they have shade in the summer. This is like... That, that's my best advice for you if you didn't know that. <laughs> Next, I have two things from Essence. I have the Juicy Bomb in Pink Lemonade. This is, I got this this year from Influencer, so I am going to keep it. Um, and then this is Happy. Hmm, I can't tell. I'll keep Happy for now. So I feel like I've never used Happy. So... Now we have all these babies, all of these, all of these. So technically these two are a duo. This is the Beach and Balm Raspberry Kiwi Splash Lip Balm. And then I think this was the matching bullet lip balm. I don't know what you call these. These are pretty much brand new. So I'm going to keep both of them. Um, Karomi from the Creme Shop has not been opened. She's in Raspberry Cream Puff flavor. So I am going to keep her. This is also new to me, but do I want to keep this? I received this as a gift from family. Oh, it's in here. It's one of the, they give you two. Oh my gosh. I guess I'll keep it for now. This is the lip balm and then the gimmick is that you apply it via a wand, a honeycomb wand, I guess is what you would call it. I'll keep it for now, but if I'm keeping it, that means I definitely have to get rid of some of these other lip balms here. The first one I'm willing to get rid of is this butter lip balm. They sold this item with a product that like similar to one of the Huda skincare products that like bubbled up I don't know how to explain it that's that this came in like duos with it I'm chucking this one um let's see I have the Becca Hydra lip Hydra light lip balm I got it from influencer I'll keep it it still smells like watermelon it's overpriced for a lip balm but I guess I'll keep it. Um, let's see. This I'm getting rid of. This is the Lovebird Tinted Lip Balm in Smile. Got it from a subscription box. Don't care for it. This I'll also get rid of. This is Lip Smackers in Coca-Cola Vanilla. I've never opened it. I don't want to open it. It's going. It's definitely from 2019. And same with the Lip Smackers in Coke. Also from 2019. It's going. As you can see, I have a lot of chapped ice. I think I'll keep the bait. Well, this baby's open. They still smell fine. So I guess I'll keep these two. Is this one opened? Open but never used. I guess I'll keep it. Um. Okay. Jeffree Star Mannequin is expired. It's going. My foot keeps falling asleep on me. It is killing me. From ColourPop, I have Scorpio Moon. This should be expired. It's expired. Good. Um, I say should be because I know some of these items are old. So if it smelled normal, that would be weird. 
Half case cosmetics holoback. Once again, that's another item that should be expired. Yeah, it's gone. It's going. No bueno. This, I, I think this is expired. It's called Candy Cosmetics Baby. Really like the brand. They haven't put out any new products in a minute, which kind of scares me that they're not going to bring anything else out. But this is an amazing quality liquid lipstick. But yeah, it's expired. Um, I might honestly repurchase this. Next, from Menagerie Cosmetics, I have the liquid lipstick in Cherimoya. Also expired. This is Beauty Bakery in Sorbet on Sunday. Also expired. That one hurts me a little bit. Um, YSL. Got this through Influencer. Um, this is in 314. <laughs> it's expired. Let's go. I didn't want it in my life anyway. <laughs> um, sorry for my gremlin laugh. This is Melt Cosmetics uh, Frisky. Oh my god, I hate this thing. Honestly, I might declutter it just because of that. Yeah, I'm, it, it's fine. I could use it. Um, but I hate this cap, so it's gone. Um, next is from BH Cosmetics, the Doja Cat Lip Balm. It don't smell like anything, so I guess I'll keep it for now. This one is old, so I'm going to get rid of it. This is from Taste Seasons, a hot cocoa lip balm. This has never been opened, but it's a lip balm from Beauty Tree. I think it's the dollar store brand. It's still good. I guess I'll keep it. I guess. This one, I can't show you the back. This is a hemp seed lip tint oil. Um, it's in cherry. Does it still smell like cherries? No. I'm going to throw it out. And then the last two products remaining. I have a Gale Beauty lip balm. Uh, that company no longer exists. I'm going to keep this for a Project Fan finale, and then I'm going to chuck it. And then this is from Believe Beauty, which is um, Dollar General's brand, if that still exists. This is Peach Mimosa. And it is expired. So, I will count everything and put the counts on screen, but this is what's remaining. This is actually making me excited. This is, I can use this stuff. I'm like not getting analysis paralysis, you know? Um, excited to use it and love it and pan it without hating it. Thank you so much for watching this long video. Hopefully it was semi-entertaining. Um, and if you enjoy me, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and all that jazz. Peace out, Girl Scout.